Hey guys, it's Renee. Welcome to this Coffee Mug Set Earrings. We need some clay. You don't need that much at all, and you can use polymer clay as well if you prefer. The first thing that I'm going to be doing is the tiny bowl of the coffee mug itself. For that, I'm going to be using this detailed brush. For this, I'm going to be using the back of the making a hole. And yeah, I'm just going to arrange the whole thing until I'm happy with uh, the shape of it. For the little plate, I'm going to be taking a small uh, bowl of clay, push it like that, so it creates like a circle. And then I'm going to be pushing it with my tiny brush, and then I'm going to be adding some water. Less is more when it comes to this. And then I'm going to be putting my bowl on top. The water, in this case, adds like a glue. I'm going to be taking the smallest piece of clay and I'm going to be putting that in that hole. And this is going to be like the coffee of the mug. I'm going to let the whole thing dry. I'm going to be cutting this with my cutter in for each earring and just be real careful. Clay hardens, but you can still cut it and that's why I love it. Then I'm going to be making the little handle of uh, the coffee mug. For that, I'm going to be taking the tiniest bit of clay. I'm going to roll it and then I'm going to be doing this, helping myself with some water, the tiniest, tiniest bit of water. And I'm just going to be arranging the whole thing like this. This, I believe, is the hardest part of the whole thing because of the detailed little pieces that you're gluing together. But it's not impossible. And it's so much fun to just put the whole thing together. I'm going to be taking two ear posts and some glue. And uh, the glue that I'm using is actually for nails. But this is the one that has been working for me. And I took the lid off just to know how much I have left. And then I'm going to be using this vintage white paint with a brush and I'm going to be pretty much covering the whole uh, earring. You can use any color that you want. If you don't want them in white, you can use black, gold, silver. It's pretty much up to you. Teal would look pretty cool as well. But yeah, I'm just going to be giving this few coats until it's uh, covered. Then I'm going to be using some gold acrylic paint and a tiny brush and I'm going to paint the coffee. And I thought about adding more design to the coffee mugs because I thought they were too plain and simple. But for the scale of things, like this is tiny and if I added a design, it wouldn't look good because of the size of it. Then I'm going to be using this glass by Sculpey with a brush and I'm going to be covering the whole thing. This is going to help me with the design uh, to make this look prettier. Also, it's going to help me with paint because it's going to protect the design. I think overall with this, they look way better. And yeah, these are the earrings that I wanted to share with you. I'm a coffee drinker, I can't deny this. I love coffee and I wanted to make something inspired by my love of coffee and my love of coffee mugs. I think they're so cute. I actually made this once before just to show you how you can go for different designs. This pair were actually the ones that inspired me to want to show you how to make them. If you drink coffee, tea, water, whatever, and you love coffee max as well, hopefully you like this idea too. They are so easy to make and so much fun to wear. And yeah, I really like them. Hopefully you like them too. If you did, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel for more stuff. I upload twice a week and share it. Thank you so much for watching. I'll talk to you later and take care. Bye guys.